tuned in to the Keep It Real show, and I'm sitting right here with Lonzel Hill and Joe Kelly, some former NFL stars who take the time out of their life to help out the youth in Cincinnati and various parts of the world. I'm sitting here with them. I'm amazed. So I'm going to let them tell, uh, tell you a little bit more about themselves. Why don't you go ahead and start? Well, uh, with myself, I'm, I'm born and raised in South Central L.A. Um, uh, came, out of, come out, came out of L.A., got a scholarship to the University of Washington. Uh, and from there, I was a first-round pick in 1986 in the Cincinnati Bengals, back when the Bengals were worth watching. <laughs> uh, we were, you know, I was blessed and, and fortunate enough to uh, uh, go to the Super Bowl. You know, we came up a little short. You know, but just just that experience alone was uh, has been a, a lifelong uh, uh, thing for for myself. Uh, but I, w I was fortunate enough to play uh, 11 years. Uh, started 11 years in the NFL. Actually played for six different teams. You know, I uh, I was uh, traded up to New York in 1990. I was there three years. And prior to that, there wasn't free agency with all the crazy money that they get now. So we didn't have that. But in 1993. Fortunate to have free agency, so I, I uh, went from the Jets uh, to the Raiders, led the Raiders to tackles, uh, <laughs> left there, went to the, the Rams. Last year, the Rams were uh, in LA, um, and then they sold to St. Louis. So I went from the Rams to Green Bay Packers, actually retired, unretired. Uh, I had a coach from the Rams who uh, coached linebackers for the Eagles. He called me uh, a couple weeks before training camp, and I played my last year in Philadelphia for the Eagles. Uh, and myself, uh, played with Joe Kelly, uh, University of Washington, and that's where, uh, I mean, 20 some years ago, and that's where we, we, we got this bond. Um, we uh, also was second round draft choice to the New Orleans Saints. Uh, before, uh, they were the Aints, you know them as, and my first year we went 12 and 3 and we broke that string. <laughs> uh, and that's what's up. And, uh, you know, it, it is a blessing just to be here. Uh, my guy Joe Kelly, uh, working with these youth, has been you know, trying to get me here for about 19 years. Uh, and finally, uh, I'm here, you know, because there's a, a need in, in Cincinnati that he expressed to me. And uh, that's what we've been doing in, in Seattle. Uh, my wife and I, she's also here. Um, I also played nine years professional. My last, uh, my first uh, uh, five in New Orleans. Uh, then I finished up in Canada, uh, Hamilton Tiger Cat. Uh, but the blessing now is that, uh, you know, we see, I see us as guiders and providers. You know, we're guiding the youth in a direction and providing with opportunities that they're not, uh, that they're not given uh, on a daily basis. Right. And, that's, and that's what we need. And that's what excites me now. You know, I'm a, I'm a ball player, you know, and that gets the attention, you know, we, um, you know, so, you know, everybody want to be a ball player. We're the best in the world. Right. And that's, uh, that catches that attention. So that, that gives us an opportunity to, to get that ear. And once we get that ear, we can guide you and provide you uh, in the ways that, you know, that they need to be. One, one, one other thing that we both felt to mention that uh, we are actually fortunate and blessed uh, to be voted on uh, the best at our positions uh, in the University of Washington history. Uh, and University of Washington has a strong football uh, tradition. So uh, they had an all-century team. And uh, both Lonzel Hill and I uh, were uh, basically voted, you know, the best linebacker. I, I'll take that on. <laughs> University of Washington has said Yeah, I, I, I'll take that uh, best receiver. University of Washington. In the history. <laughs> in history. Do you understand that? <laughs> but congratulations to both you guys, man. I'm very proud of you, and I'm very proud of what y'all doing here in the city, man. We, we're going to make sure that we get all the information out so everybody can work with Kelly Youth Services. I know it's going to be something something great going on in the city because we don't have too many people reaching back like you guys. So, man, we appreciate that so much. We appreciate that so much. And I'm going to still talk with y'all more right after this video. Keep it real.